Okay, hey Anna, it's 7 in the morning and I just watched your video, but I figured I might as well just make my video now, because I don't, I don't know, I, I felt like it. Um, my hair is still wet, because I'm yet to do anything to it, so... First off, I thought I would touch on the girl thing again, just because... I don't know if it came across that I was, like, more frustrated, but it was, like, less being frustrated, more just being confused, because I think with the people I surround myself with, it's, like, it's weird... <laughs> Because I'm just so used to, like, everyone I know being really accepting and really, like, ha! Ah. So it's just, it's just, like, different. I don't know. Um, speaking of that class, I wrote the short little play. Ooh. Ooh. It's called Letters to Maria, and it's about a man and a woman. It was limited to two characters. It's about a man and a woman. Betty and Tim. Bad names. I like Betty, I don't like Tim, but anyway. Um, married couple, been married for like 23 years, and basically Tim was cheating, and he'd been in an affair for like a year, and it was just like, I don't know, really simple, really simple kind of plot, but I don't know. But basically, the whatever, the woman came by to get him or whatever, but he was still at work, and eventually the wife, she found, she finds like letters, and so basically the only part of it I actually like is, um, when she wants him to confess, she starts, like, reading aloud the letters, and when they get steamy, like, get, start to get more, like, steamy, that's when he's like, okay, okay, okay. Um, I didn't leave a lot of room for, like, some weird plot twist at the end, so I just kind of, like, had her go into this rant about, like, before, the, like, early on in their marriage when she was still working, when she was, like, a police officer and kind of just, like, going on about how he probably doesn't remember and, uh, yeah. Do you remember 20 years ago? We were married then, but I still have my job. It was for I trusted you enough to be the only source of income, but when I trusted you, I would be your only lady. Ooh. Yeah. I don't know. Mom liked it. <laughs> uh, yeah. What else? I feel like I had something else. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Tomorrow is Friday, and we have Friday off for some reason, but it's also, like, a birthday celebration thing with my friend Emily, because her birthday is the 26th, like many other people I know for some reason. So we're doing that, and we're just having it over here, and then, like, going over there. And, um... Um, 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 um. I'm kind of worried for the fact that I don't... I don't know. Like... There's, there's gonna be, like, people there who I don't know if I consider myself as close to as I used to, but we kind of just, like, invite them because we still do talk to them. So I don't know if it's gonna be, like, uncomfortable and, like, how do you have a party? How do you, like, amuse people? The plan is basically just, like, food and tournaments on, like, the Wii and stuff like that. Just, I don't, I don't know. What else do you do at party things? I, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know, Anna. Okay. Do I have anything else to talk about? Uh, I don't think so. Okay. This thing is my life, and I play with it all the time, and it's out of control. Ugh. Oh. Okay. I know something. So in graphic design, we had to make a logo for, like, a thing. A thing. Like a company or a shop or something, and so I made my shop. It was called T-Pit. Like teapot, but tea pit because it's a place, and I I liked it, and it was just like a dumb logo. I don't know. And um, now we're to the point where we had to make a mascot. So I designed my mascot, and it's really really cute. It's like an elephant, but it's like a teapot. It's like a teapot elephant, and so I just like made the turn around, and it's white, and it has like purple things on the bottom of their sh feet. Like, the thing, it has purple of those, and, like, red cheeks, and it's white, and it's really cute. And we get to sew that. And when I designed it, I kind of knew what I was getting myself into, but I, like, made a really complicated thing to sew, but I believe in myself to do it. It's... I just hope that I don't, like, accidentally make it too big and use too much fabric, because that would be mean. But, yep, okay, I will cut off this video now, and I'll see you tomorrow, Anna, and I will talk to you on Monday. Yep. Okay. Peace out. Bye.